Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So in this video I am sharing this red eye makeup look with neutral lips. But before starting the video make sure you subscribe to my channel. Press the bell icon for notification. I post reviews, DIYs and tutorials. So stay connected by subscribing. You can also follow me on my social medias. The links are in the description box along with the other links of my previous videos. Make sure that you check them out and let me know if they were helpful for you or not. So without wasting some more time, let's start the video. So this kind of makeup look I usually don't do and all the things actually messed up in this makeup look. Now for moisturizing my face, I'm using the Bio Bloom face oil and for eyebrows, I'm using Maybelline Duo Shaper eyebrow pencil. Now this is in the shade dark brown and I wanted my eyebrows to be a little more darker. So later on, I even used a black pencil also. For primer, I'm using Colorbar Perfect Match Primer. This is a silicone based primer and I'm applying it on the areas that usually produce more oil and that is a mighty zone area. moisturize my lips I'm using Patanjali lip balm now recently I have posted a video for lip balm different kinds of lip balm I will leave the link in the description box if you want you can check it out for color correcting I'm using LA girl pro conceal HD peach corrector lost my black color eyebrow pencil and I was not getting it so I applied a kajal it is by blue heaven but I applied it very lightly now please do not use a kajal on your eyebrows firstly because it is made for your eyes not for your eyebrows and secondly if it by chance if it melts it will ruin all your makeup I did so because mujhe kahi jala nahi tha and I was just shooting for the video so I did this but make sure you use a eyebrow pencil instead of a kajal. Using a damp beauty blender, I am just blending all the corrector. I have a full video over how you can do your concealing and correcting and I will leave the link in the description box. If you want, you can check it out. So for concealer, here I am using Lacme Absolute Concealer. I don't remember the shade. I think this is the lightest one from this range. Using a flat brush, I am just blending all the concealer. Now to bake the under eyes, I am using a Lacme Pink Rose Powder. It is a loose powder and I am applying a little more amount so that it can bake the concealer and the corrector so it don't budge anywhere and even if I apply the eyeshadow it can catches the fallout. 
so now i'm using the nika k23 color eyeshadow palette and i'm using this uh, red and orange mix shade on my crease actually i'll be applying this only this shade on my eyelids all over my eyelids so i really don't do these kind of eye, eye makeups like i don't use a such bright colors like i don't think you have ever seen my videos with a red or yellow kind of shades i have not tried them most probably i'll do these kind of eye looks in future but for now i really don't prefer doing so but this this look i was doing just for a trial purpose but it eventually turned out to be a good makeup look so i thought of uploading it instead of that i'm using this gray shade from the palette and i'm taking it on an angular brush and i will apply it as an eyeliner so if you found any problem in applying an eyeliner i have a video on how easily you can apply your eyeliner i will leave the link in the description box you can check it out pretty small eyes so i don't like underlining all my lower lash line with a kajal or with an eye shadow so i usually just apply a little bit of whatever is left on the brush till one third of my lower lash line taking the same gray shade i'm drawing a long wing from the eyes i usually don't do this i i'm just a fan of short wing liner and my eyes are also short so they does not uh, not long wing liner does not look pretty well on them but this was just for a trial purpose For my base makeup, I actually chose NY Bay Liquid Foundation, and the color was shade number one. And this foundation is so white from my natural skin tone. I actually, when I bought it, when I was selecting it, I thought the shade will match, but it didn't, and the foundation turned out to be really white, and it does not blend really well with the brush with the beauty blender. you can blend it with your fingers if you are using this it blends pretty well with the fingers but not with a brush or a beauty blender like uh, if you uh, if you see a close up of your face you can uh, find the strokes of the brush hair so blend it with your fingers if you are using this so it took a lot of time to blend this foundation and as you can notice my face was looking of different colors so i applied the same foundation under my under my eyes also so actually i applied 
uh, loose powder before this so later on I just dabbed a little bit of uh, powder so that it can set bring back some color and shape to my face I used the contour color and this is Bharat and Doris foundation I will leave all the shade numbers in the description box now this also I applied a little more that it took a lot of time in blending the only reason of uploading this makeup look is that if you have makeup products that don't work for you so you can get an idea how you can use them Just to highlight the bridge of my nose and cupid's bow, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. For the blush, I am using the same shade that I used on my eyelids. For lipstick, I have used this very light pink peachy kind of shade from Essence. It is a lip gloss. And then I'm just tapping a little bit of a Maybelline lip crayon. It is in a pink shade. So as highlighter, I have used Makeup Revolution Baked Highlighter and I have just applied the highlighter in the inner corners of my eyes and on the brow bone. I have not applied the highlighter on my cheekbones like you can see the foundation itself is so shiny that my cheekbones are shining so I didn't feel like applying any highlighter but obviously you can change, you can add or subtract any step that you want so i hope you liked the video and if you liked it then do share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel till my next video take care and bye bye